and a Westlaco boxing gym won't be opening in the next couple of weeks as was planned. As Channel 5's Cecilia Gutierrez reports Monday's rainfall isn't the only reason for the delay. Noe Mendoza's gym doesn't see much action. He was hit by last year's flood in the middle of those repairs. His business got hit again. Everything is just dead now. It's, we just don't know what to do anymore. Mendoza opened the Las Brisas boxing gym out of his garage a couple of years ago. This is where he and his son train kids in the neighborhood to fight like champions until recently. Our gym was kind of destroyed. We have leaks. We have uh, mechanical issues that we need to work on. Some of the equipment, or most of our equipment got damaged from our from our first flood. He says this is the eighth time the neighborhood is flooded since 2000. This time his home was spared, but the damage to the boxing season is done. We were getting ready to start opening it up again for this summer to get ready for the Games of Texas this year again that will be held in College Station. And, uh, and it's not going to happen again. Mendoza says he knows county leaders are trying to help. The amount of rainfall so close to the anniversary of last year's disaster was too much. I'm a firm faith believer in that project is going to work, so we might just weigh it out up until then, and then after that, that detention pond is uh, finally finished and it happens again where it doesn't function, then we're back to, we're back to square one. He's thinking about moving now. He doesn't want to go through this again. One thing has him holding on. You know, we're in ground zero. You know, this is, this is where Las Brisas Boxing Club, the idea of an academic academically inclined boxing gym was born. You know, my first graduate, my son, Noe Jr., uh, spearheading the Texas NM boxing team. Mendoza says all he can do now is pray there's no more heavy rain or tropical systems through the end of hurricane season. In Westlaco, Cecilio Gutierrez, Channel 5 News, this weekend.